Good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're certainly in the mood for Champions League group stage action. It is Victoria Pilsen up against Bayern Munich. Well, Derek, these were very good in their opening games. Both look to be in top form. This should be a great game today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And so the starting 11 for Bayern. Jan Sommer is the goalkeeper. Dayo Upamecano plays with Matthijs de Ligt in central defence. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Thomas Müller. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Can he take them on and beat them? Options in the centre. What's he going to do here? Muller. Oh, big opportunity. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jan Kopitz. They've given it away. Well, very effective play in possession. No worries for the keeper. Lukas Kalvach. Well, spot on with that challenge. Must be! That is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. to worry about here now oh, they've given him too much space and making use of his physical strength to hang on to it and giving the ball away And gobbled up with ease by the keeper.
Really a very poor ball. Serge Gnabry. Well, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. Serge Gnabry untidy on the ball Bucha excellent assessment of the situation at the back not to be advised giving the ball away there Superb stop. Now can they counter clinically? Pavar. He's going forward well here. No way through. And successfully cut out. What's he going to do here? Muller. Could be. Chance maybe. Danger averted for now. Now they've lost it. This is looking threatening. And no joy as far as the cross was concerned. And there to intervene. Not the best challenge, free kick. Well, the referee saw it as a bookable offence. And I think he's got it absolutely right. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. A bit sloppy in possession. Well, as you can see, Bayern have had much less of the ball. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Tomas Kori. And Kimi couldn't keep it. Thomas Müller. Poor pass under no real pressure. And continues his run. Shot attempted. Able to get a body in the way. Goretzka. Now Coman. Well, that looked to be quite dangerous, but just a fraction off. Well, half-time coming up shortly. It's a story of Bayern on top. Stuart, your take. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Halva. Milan Havel. 
Mosquera. And he saw the situation developing. Now the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Serge Gnabry. And players wait. Muller! So Bayern get ready for their set-piece routine, hoping to increase their lead. Played over. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Yes, there's certainly room for improvement. He struggled to have any real impact on the game. He hasn't gotten the ball enough, and when he has, he's given it away cheaply. But I'm sure we'll see a marked improvement in the second half. And this Champions League group today... And the second half of this Champions League group stage meeting is underway. around it and, and credit is due for that good piece of defending this looks more than decent gets it a go oh that's textbook goalkeeping Ever deeper. 
Napri. Tomas Shokori. Well, he's lost it. Joao Cancelo. And, and Kimi. Serge Gnabry. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, the situation has changed in the Barcelona match. Let's get details from Alex Scott. It's a goal for Inter. It was a nice one-two, and then he coolly slotted it around the goalkeeper. It's all even Stevens at 1-1 with 71 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Gnabry. Muller. Come on! Teams separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is so clinical. He just rolls it past the keeper, cool as you like. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Just 15 minutes remaining. Good technique displayed. Well, disappointing end to the move. So on the cusp of the final whistle, and the visitors very much in command, Stuart. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward, and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. plan, an own goal it is and no wonder his head is slumped well here it is again and quite clearly that's an own goal, he's a bit unfortunate really Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Coppins. Still a chance. But wait a minute, that is offside. And time for the change now. Serge Gnabry Jamal Musiala Nicely timed tackle Vidra The ball with Corey And the counter attack is on Options available And it looked like open road for them But up a dead end Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Vidra. And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. A concession of a corner here. Over it comes. And a good take under duress there. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile.
work to win the ball back. And there it is, officially the end of the game. Bayern get the victory and take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, another excellent result, and it's the perfect start. Of course, they're not through yet, but another good performance, and they'll surely make the knockout stages. A pacey and explosive Kingsley Coman, a force to be reckoned with, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. Options in the centre. What's he going to do here? Muda. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. That is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goal. And there to intervene. Well, the referee saw it as a bookable offence. And I think he's got it absolutely right. That was a poor challenge you have. So Bayern get ready for their set-piece routine, hoping to increase their lead. Now, who can he play it to? Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Muller. And he might be through here. Still alive. Oh, a goal! And that wasn't part of the plan. A known goal it is, and no wonder his... Vidra. And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. The concession of a corner here. 